Okay, here's the third example from Algebra 1, Chapter 3, Section 4. I'm now going to find three consecutive odd integers. So very similar to the last one. Again, consecutive means in a row, odd. So if I'm at um, 9, 11, 13, to get from one to the next, I'm still going to be adding two. One to the next, I'm still adding two. So I'm talking about odd integers in a row. And to get from one to the next, I'm adding two each time. So my first integer, since I don't know what it is, we'll call that x. x is my first. My second integer, again, from get from 1 to the next, I'm going to add 2. So that's going to be an x plus 2 again. That's going to be my second one. And my third integer, again, starting from the first one, I added 2. I added 2 more. So that's x plus 4 for my third one. Third. So now we're back to finding the sum that is 57. So I'm going to take my first one, which was x, and I'm going to add it to my second one, which is x plus 2. And then I'm going to add it to my third one, which was x plus 4. And we said that is 57 means I'm just going to add them all up and get 57. So now I just need to combine like terms. So I've got x, x, and x. So there's three x's. And I've got a plus 2 and a plus 4. So that's plus 6. And that is 57. Next step would be to get rid of the um, addition or subtraction. So I'm going to subtract 6 from both sides. The 6 is cancel. The 3x comes straight down. And 57 minus 6 is 51. And is 51 divisible by 3? Well, 5 plus 1 is 6. Then 6 is divisible by 3, so I know 51 is. So then I can divide both sides by 3. Divide by 3. Divide by 3. 3 divided by 3 is 1. So I know x is going to be equal to, well, 3 goes into 5 one time with 2 left over. And 3 goes into 21 seven times. So at my x is 17. So my first integer is 17. So I'll go back up here. And I know that my x is 17. So then I want to grab my x plus 2. My x plus 2 would then be 19. And my x plus 3 would be equal to 21. And then again, we want to verify, does it exactly get us 57 like we want? So I take 17, 19, and 21, and I add them all up. And 9 plus 1 is 10, plus 7 is 17. So 2, 3, 4, 5, and I do, in fact, get 57. So here is my answer. 17, 19, and 21 are three consecutive odd integers whose sum is 57.